Any fiber technician worth their weight will stand by the fact that some of the most essential tools in their day-to-day -day operations are a black work mat and a reliable cleaver. Let's begin with the star of the show, the black work mat. This may seem like a simple piece of equipment, but we'd argue that seeing the bare fibers is an essential part of the job. The black work mat helps prevent reflection and glare since fiber optics are light sensitive. It minimizes reflection, thus allowing better visibility when working with fiber, and the contrast between the black mat and the fiber ensures you are able to see exactly what you are doing. Another big advantage, cleanliness. The black mat makes it easy to spot dirt, dust, and debris, hoping you keep your workspace clean. Fiber optics need to be handled in a dust-free environment to avoid signal interference or damage to the fiber. Here's a good comparison. On the left side, we're using an orange work mat. Notice how much harder it is to see the bare fiber. Now on the right side, we're using the black work mat, and you can clearly see the difference. Visibility matters. Now let's talk cleavers. In front of me are several types of cleavers we offer here at Cable Wholesale. You might be wondering, what exactly are cleavers used for? Cleavers are tools used to precisely cut and prepare the ends of optical fiber for splicing and termination, but not all cleavers are the same. Here's a quick rundown of some of the types of cleavers that you will encounter in the field. The first one is called a manual or field cleaver. These are often used with quick term connectors and are one of the most cost effective methods. Here's how it works. Press the lever and insert the fiber. Release the lever. Then press down on the head to score the fiber. Then bend the spring loaded arm to break the fiber in a clean and controlled manner. Now on the other hand you have precision cleavers. A precision cleaver uses a wheel shaped blade to make a perfect flat cut that leaves a 90 degree cleave angle on the end of the fiber. This is important when performing fusion splices. Precision fiber cleavers usually work as follows. Open the fiber clamp and the cover plate and put the bare fiber into the fiber holder. Align the strip jacket of the fiber with the ruler to get a specific fiber length. Position the fiber past the cleaving blade, then close the fiber clamp and the cover. Now gently push the sliding block to cleave the fiber. Open the cover plate and the fiber clamp and remove the cleaved fiber. There are also one step cleavers in which you just push down the lid and the cleaver does everything else, like pushing the blade and disposing of the fiber. Using the cleavers with the work mat makes working with fiber a breeze.